What's up guys, this is Ferrant here. This is the water animation tutorial. Um, first of all, what we want to do <coughs> is get a, a, a material of water. So you want to go to create, low material preset, visualize materials, nature, and you can come into the water. So you can get like pool, I'm just going to import a few just so we can see which one looks better. Ocean. We'll just do one more. Um, we'll do a lake. So we'll, if we just get a plane, we can now add our water to it. Maybe add a light. I think a light should help. Kind of. Maybe it's just the um, the material. So yeah, here we go. It's got reflection. If I just take the light off, that is like a it's sort of like a water but that's sort of the effect you're gonna get I think the middle one's better so we're just gonna stick to that um, give me a minute there we go that one yeah that one looks right so now we've got our plane with the material on we wanna go to displacer drag the displacer in click on the shading tab come to the little arrow and check noise and that will already like turn it into the sort of like a, a water type effect um, you want to come to the object tab and hit the strength to about 300 or I'll just go a little bit higher 350 um, and obviously it's all jagged in that but we just add a hypernerbs and drag the plane into the hypernerbs and then that will obviously smooth out so then once we've done all this we want to actually animate it so if you click on the displacer and then you go to the shading tab again where it says noise just click on that it'll bring up all the settings you want to change the global scale to about 500 and the relative scale to about 500 and that adds like sort of a wave type effect as you can see um, the animation speed you want to 1 the movement you want this end one to be one so it goes in sort of like a wave pattern and the speed change it to about one as well so we've got like a sort of a, a wave type thing now if we go back which one was it it said visualize nature they're all animated apparently so if we just go back to this one no you can't see that one very well can you neither that one, nah, that's probably the best one um, so yeah that is sort of like how you do a wave effect there was another way I had like to get a good um, here we go, if you could just drag in the highlights um, I don't see why I think you probably needed a sky, I'm not I'm not too sure because if I just t turn that off the ski, the, the, the C, sorry hide that um, the material does not does not really work, so I don't know. I'm just going to try something here. I've got because I've loaded it in. I've got the material, and that's a nice water effect because I know I've used it before. So if I try that and add a sky, so I mean it's, it's a bit funny, and I'll just add a sunlight. See what I mean? I don't I don't see why it's not like wanting to do it because if I just delete all that and I just go to this uh, we go to delete the camera you know and you know that's fine look at that wall uh, that wall is like perfect um, so yeah you could probably much, pretty much do the same just um, animate this water but you'll have to change the settings a lot higher and you're gonna have to test around with that but that's sort of how you make animating water so yeah I'll just leave you to do what you can with it make up your own shizzle so peace see you in the next video